Good everyone, you're watching Radio Fixes. In this video, I'm going to talk about how to fix the error message application not found in Windows. Now, you might come across this error message whenever you're trying to insert a DVD or a USB drive, or maybe if you uh, click on the hyperlinks in an email. I'm going to talk about fix this error message when you're trying to insert a DVD or a USB drive. Now, the first thing what you will have to do is uh, you will have to open Registry Editor. To do this, you can do a right click on the Start button and then click on Run. In the Run window, you may go ahead and type reg edit and click on ok in case if you get a user access control prompt you may click on yes or continue on the screen now once you have the registry editor open you will have to collapse all the registry keys until you have the registry keys in this order now please note when you're trying to make any registry changes make sure you follow the steps carefully in case if you make any incorrect modification there are chances that your computer might go to a no boot mode now once your registry key is in this order you will have to go ahead and expand H key current user under H key current user you will have to go ahead and expand software so you may click on this triangle under software you will have to look it for Microsoft and then expand Microsoft under Microsoft look for Windows it would be in alphabetical order expand Windows under X Windows you will have to go ahead and locate for current version and expand it and then look for Explorer once you have selected Explorer on the right hand side you would see a message which says mom point two. Once you see this uh, registry key, you will have to go ahead and delete it. So you can do a right click and then click on delete. And that close the register editor, restart your computer with that, that you should not get any error message when you try to insert a USB or a DVD drive on your computer. Now, if you receive this message, when you click on the hyperlinks in an email, you will have to follow some of the steps. To do this, you will have to open a notepad on your computer. So in the search window you may go ahead and type notepad and that should see you should see the best match for notepad double click on it once you have the notepad open you will have to copy the text from my video description i will mention this steps in the video description copy the text and paste it here on the notepad once you have basically what you're doing is you're creating a registry key for your windows so once you have this registry entries or entries in the notepad you will have to click on file and then click on save as and you will have to go ahead and save this file as reg key dot reg make sure it is in this extension you can give the name of your choice however the key the extension needs to be dot reg and then click on save once you have this you may close the notepad and then navigate to the location where you have uh, the file saved in my case i have saved this file on the desktop so once you have navigated to the location you will have to double click on it in case if you get an op a prompt which says do you want to allow this app to make changes to your device you may click on yes and then click on yes again click on ok close this window restart your computer and then go to the email where you're trying to open the hyperlinks and that should fix the problem so the dub so this will allow your run dll 32.exe file to function properly and with this you should resolve this issue so in spite of trying all this step and if you're still facing a problem i would suggest you to leave me a comment in the the comment section so that i can come up with the possible solution i hope this video was useful in case if you like this video please make sure to hit the like button and do not forget to subscribe to my channel thank you have a great day